Lens eight is weight compensation. It's where you take the weight of one thing and use weight, another's lift to compensate for it. Uh, you can think of a simple example as if you have uh, products that aren't moving real well with ones that are out of inventory, bundle them together. All right? um, a lot of what I do is people can't afford my workshop fee, so instead of money, I'll ask for a trade. I just did something with a TV station in Canada where they couldn't afford me, but I gave them a workshop and they shot me in the studio and doing a 60 second commercial and they're running on TV for me. So we traded that. There's all, especially in today's environment, there's so much barter stuff. Anyone from Tennessee? My wife's from Tennessee. They don't, okay, they don't exchange cash in Tennessee, except in Nashville. Everything else is a bale of hay for pork, right? Everyone <laughs> trades everything there, but. This guy, so when he lost the election, what did he do for weight compensation so he could stay in the limelight? After he invented the internet, right? He attached himself to global warming. He attached himself to it to give himself lift so that he stayed in the public eye. Now you guys are gonna think I just added this chart, but I didn't, I've had this chart up there forever, her. When he lost the election, I go, I guarantee she will not disappear because she went from Alaska, and nobody ever heard of her, to the limelight, she will attach herself to something. Right now, it's her book, right? Weight compensation. Uh, the guy that was editing this, the Da Vinci and 40 Answers book, the one that Roy mentioned we have in the bookstore, um, he started laughing on weight compensation. He goes, I got a story you need to put in there. I go, okay. He goes, when I was in high school, I had this car I was trying to sell because I wanted to get a new one. And it used to be a really good car, but it had got a little bit of wear on it. And I couldn't get anyone to even come look at this car. <clears throat> because nobody would look at it, I couldn't sell it. And, but everyone wanted to date my sister because she was hot. So he said, hey sis, take one for the team. What if I offer, his sister, he says, what if I offer that they get a first date with you if they buy the car? He got three offers that day and got more money than he was asking for. He took something nobody wanted, his car, with something that they did. See, that's a very non-technical example that's real. Take one for the team, sis. 